Here we have our SD1 deployed. The FortiGate hub can be connected to SASE for many reasons. For SPA, for example, or secure private access. If people all over the place want to access these applications, they can get there through SASE because SASE is connected to the hub. Even if these applications are behind a spoke FortiGate, so you have ZTNA for private access, you have SPA, secure private access. For branches, you have thin edges. Remote users can connect to a 40 AP or a 40 LAN extension for the extender and they will be connected to a pop as well and from that they can also get back to the data center or to those private applications that are hosted over there one thing i need to mention is the sd1 on ramp with this one with on ramp any device that you have that is ipsec certified or that can do ipsec can create an ipsec tunnel to 40 sassy and all the users behind that device whatever brand it is or whatever model it is as long as you can have ipsec connectivity to 40 sassy it's going to have 40 sassy as a default gateway and all your traffic will go through 40 sassy so your remote branches can connect to 40 sassy directly your home users can use the agentless solution or the agent uh, based solution with 40 clients at home in coffees in airplanes they can now connect to a certain pop and work without any problem i think you realize how easy it is to deploy all of this all the different scenarios using this centralized point that is 40 sassy